Harden is expected to win the MVP award this season, and he could even be a unanimous choice. But LeBron James has someone else in mind if he had a vote. Himself. LeBron said, I would vote for me. The body of work, how I'm doing it, what's been happening with our team all year long, how we've got so many injuries and things of that nature. Guys, in and out, to be able to still keep this thing afloat, I would definitely vote for me. I'm joined by FS1 NBA analyst Steven Jackson. Welcome. Stacks, I tried to hit the fool with the big stack. So what do you feel with it? I know somebody else will vote for him. Like, yeah. Under time, exactly. like fan votes where you just keep... I'm stuffing the ballot box. Yeah. The computer's a computer. <laughs> Do you like that LeBron said this? I'm not surprised. I said this early. He's the only superstar that has to be told he's great. Uh, he's been patting himself on the back all year. This is the first year he's done that, so I don't know what's going on. But, um, you know, even when, after the game where he posted his stats and said, I'm just doing my part, yeah. all this stuff. This is the first time that I've seen him do this. I don't know if, what it is, why he's doing it, but I'm not surprised. But players have been selling themselves for the last couple of years. You think, of, look at All-Star. Ever since social media has been big on uh, in the NBA, a lot of guys have been promoting themselves, Both making All-Star, all, all kind of stuff. So I'm not surprised, but the best player in the league, the best player in the game, the star, this is new to me, that that he promotes himself so much. When mm. We all know he's great. We pat him on the back enough. Mm. No. You pat him, pat him on the back enough. Mm. So he shouldn't have to pat But him. I have to. I have to. I have to. I have to excessively heat praise because somebody <laughs> across from me always trying to find a reason. Trying to tell the truth? No, you ain't mm. telling no truth. Mm. Uh, yeah, I got no problem with what he said because he ain't lying. You make it seem like he lied. He ain't lying. No, he ain't lying. And could, Skip, the, the term that you like to use, I think 2018, you like to use the term degree of difficulty. Mm -hmm. And what he's been able to do. Think about this. Stack, let me, I'm, 11 days ago against the Chicago Bulls, this was LeBron James starting lineup. Jeff Green, Jose Calderon, George Hill, and Anti Zizic. That's what he started with. Yeah, that's what he. That's what he went to battle with. Do, do you want me to give the Bulls starting lineup? That's what he went to battle with. Okay. It probably was worse. Yeah, probably worse. <laughs> that's why he in the lottery. <laughs> but this team, the third seed in the East. Mm. And if you look at it, and people are like, oh, Jay. LeBron is averaging three fewer points, but LeBron is averaging more rebounds, more assists, shoots ten percent higher from the field goal, thirty-seven. James Harden from the three, LeBron is 36, and uh, Harden shoots, uh, takes 10 attempts, LeBron six. Mm -hmm. So it's not as far-fetched as one would think. Mm. I don't have no problem. See, we all, they always say, I want the athlete to be honest. Why don't you tell the truth? Don't give us that, oh, God, it's just gee whiz. And the man tell you, yeah, I need it. Mm -hmm. I should be it. Mm. But people like some people I know, you two stacks, no, you ain't getting up out of here. Yeah, I'm with you. Yeah. Don't want to get that man his credit. I told you. Mm -hmm. Barney Porter told me, said, boy, you don't need nobody to pat you on the back mm -hmm. as long as you got two good hands. Right. Pat mm -hmm. yourself on the back. Mm -hmm. And LeBron is doing it. Doing a good job of it, too. Mm. You know, like what he do tonight. You know, Betty my, have a triple dub. You know what my mom always told what me? What'd she say? You're going to break your arm trying to pat yourself on the back. <laughs> <laughs> you ever hear that one? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so I want to repeat what the great Steven Jackson just said a moment ago. He's the only superstar that has to be told he's great. The only superstar, and that's true. I've been telling you that all year. He, he is the biggest self-promoter in the history of sports at the highest level, and he is at the highest level. We all get that and know that, but that's for us to decide, not for him to tell us to decide. Sometimes you forget. You know, so, you so, don't tell me. But then when you forget, why don't you tell me? 15 years? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Y'all been told every year for 15 years. That's not enough? Mm -mm. <laughs> so I'm going to take this seriously because offensively, he is off the charts. And he's yes. trying to make a statement that in year 15, no one has ever done this. And I give you that. Mm -hmm. Does that make him the MVP of the league? No. Not at all. But, but he, is, he is blazing new territory. He, he's setting a new standard for a year 15 player that I've never seen before. And he looks sensational. His body, it, it, it looks like it's the best it's ever been. I, I give you all that. So where would so let me ask you a question. If he had, let's just say he had a, a CJ McCullum all year, or he had a Chris Paul all year, where would LeBron James be? We but we can't do that. We got to deal with the task at hand. Well, so he needs to be MVP. Wait, then. it ain't. Then, wait a second. The biggest thing is they need to worry about losing games with Kelly O'Leary being the, mm -hmm. the leading scorer. Going into the playoffs, that's the bigger picture. We don't worry about no seed. Didn't I tell you about that seed? Bigger picture. It could be a mustard seed. 
a pumpkin seed. Yeah. And LeBron James will take that and a bottle of water and make it grow into the Eastern Conference Finals and see the go and see the Houston Rockets in the NBA Finals. Wait, That's what he can do. Wait, LeBron James' team got bullied by Man Bun last night? Yeah. By Kelly O'Leary? Yeah. He just dominated Mickey, the game. I thought somebody Mickey? might have slipped them on Mickey, Mickey? or something the way they were playing. Yeah, Debo, Kevin Love, yeah, you the said, and, him, I'll get you out of here. What? And they wouldn't call no fouls on LeBron, but you uh, see when LeBron put that bow in Tyler Johnson's throat, they backed the problem with this guy. <laughs> they backed the up. That's what you got to do. Sometimes you got to just go out there like this here. So if, if LeBron had even more all-star help, then he wouldn't be able to stuff the stat sheet. Yes, he he's would. been stuffing it. And he's been stuffing it on he a had, nightly basis. He had Kyrie last year and set career highs in rebounds and assists. Well, he's now setting new career yeah! highs in rebounds and assists. And he's second in the league in assists. And he's a career best 16 triple doubles and a career best 45 double doubles. Sensational. Sensational. Okay. He is third in PER, which is not sensational because he's won PER, this player efficiency rating, six times in his career. Yeah. This is just a middling year for him. How many, PER. Guys, how many guys in year 15 have been third in PER? Well, that's the point. And that's yeah, the that, only that, point you don't, don't give that warning. Okay, but that's all. Are, you, are we doing it in year 15 or are we doing it? Are you the best oh, player in the league? Quitter. Who's, okay, well, you, since you're talking about he played defense. Wait, why don't we create a new award that'll be who's the MVP of the year 15 players? Oh, I'll give it to LeBron. Oh, that's what you did for yeah, Tom you Brady? Yeah, have that. That's what you did I for did Tom not. Brady? He yeah, won, you He won the whole award for the whole league. The 22-year-olds, are uh, they're eligible for that award. Well, let me ask you, well, you don't mind me asking. Yeah. Who's play, who played better defense, LeBron or James Harden? Neither. Uh, thank you for bringing that up. Yeah. <laughs> in defensive win shares right now, James Harden ranks 35th in the league, which is pretty high. That's Bobo. 35. You know that's a Bobo. He, he does because he, he's, he's a career high in steals, 1.8, almost two steals a game for James Harden. LeBron James has now plummeted to 346th in individual defensive He only play. dropped two spots last yeah. night after that yeah. performance? Yeah, 346. <laughs> <laughs> he's always been good at blocking shots, on ball defending. Yeah. Neither one of them good. So, so check this out. In plus minus for the year. James Harden is plus 518, which is just off the charts, right. as is Houston's record. Yeah, they ain't lost for 14 games. Uh -oh. What you expect to be? 61 and 14. That's why he's the MVP. Plus Stop. 518. What's LeBron? LeBron for the whole year is plus nine. Plus nine? Yeah. That's, that's like a 500 rating. That's like, well, what you are is you're 44 and 30, and you're only a half game ahead of the Sixers and the Pacers in the third slot. So you could fall to the fifth slot tonight. You could. You could. I bet they'll, I bet you I bet you ain't nobody oh man, I sure hope I get the Cavaliers in the first round. Who's saying that, Skip? Mm, I don't Who's know. Who's saying that, Who you think saying that? Oh, I want LeBron James in my building round one. Hey, yeah. Cleveland don't want the Bucks first round either. Yeah, they do. Well, yeah, they know. do. So, the Bucks ain't doing that. No. So, oh, yeah, actually, I think, didn't Jason Terry say that? They, hold on. They just beat the Bucks four times this year. Yeah. Mm. They four and one. Mm. I hope we get the Bucks. Mm. I guarantee you. Okay. A melee. All right. Them old hotel vacuums. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. They get all that go. Right. One time over. You ain't got to like so <laughs> one time over. The man who is promoting himself for MVP is second worst in the NBA in turnovers and a career worst 314 turnovers. And he has the fifth worst free throw percentage of his career. He's only 73% from the free throw line. This man up. can shoot. He knows that you just you, you got to make your free throws. He's going to get, get, he get on up there. He's, what are we down to, like six games left? What, yeah, we, you we lost your bet. We, you bet me a whole case of Diet Mountain. We will be 80 plus. Well, he oh, go to that was a bad bet. He, yeah, I mean, he's going to finish over 75 percent. He's going to get on a hot Well, that did, you're going to lose the bet. But that's anyway. okay. He's going to be over 75. <laughs> the turnover part, I don't really trip on because okay. if you look at the turnovers every year, the top right. five players are always at the top of the turnover. And, he, and look, at what he's try, look at the pass he's trying to make. Because we, when, when he's doing these no looks and he's bounce, skipping the ball cross court yep. and he's going between guys' legs, so he tries things. And mm -hmm. that's what good guy. I mean, he has to, though. Yeah. He has to. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But don't worry about that. He should be the MVP. So the team LeBron leads has now fallen into a tie for 28, so it's second to last in overall defense. That's not very good, man. No. They're not a very good defensive team, oh. Skip. Is it ironic that he's having the best year that he's probably ever had and they have, he has the worst team? Like, is it possible that he just no he has this season to pat, pat his stats? No. I mean, that he's is had, that possible? No. He's had worse teams. Did you remember when his first go around in Cleveland? Did you see some of those teams? They played against him. Yeah, them. yeah. The matter of fact, he got him there. The man got the team to an NBA Finals at 22. Uh, the next guy that takes wait, the team to the he, NBA Finals at 22. Wait, he lost to Broccoli. 
How did he lose to Broccoli? He got swept by Broccoli in the finals. With three, with three Hall of Famers on the roster. Three Hall of Famers you have no respect for. The three you have Hall no respect what? for Tim Duggan. Whoa, whoa, whoa. whoa. Yeah, but you Parker respect Tim and Tim Duggan, he's got no yeah, respect. Yeah, yeah, but they're Hall of Famers. Yeah. Three Hall of Famers. Oh, three. now they are. They are for the sake of this conversation. No, they were. Oh, 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 so they were before? Well, I don't think you would put them in your yeah, Hall of Famers. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Manu Ginobili, you laugh at The him. man was 22 years old. Oh. So the next 22-year-old that leads a team to the NBA Finals, y'all let me know. And his name ain't Magic. He'd been playing for four years in this league. He's a veteran. Oh, look, so there are another guy that's been playing for four years? Jason Tatum's going to be four years. Uh-uh. Yeah. Jason Tatum's a rookie. Now, I'm saying in four years, he'll be, in four years, he'll be, what, he's 19 now? Yeah. Yeah, so he'll be 23. Right. Well, go on, go on, take them Celtics. Well, he might be in the finals this year. Go on, you know. Yeah. Well, he just might. Cleveland might not. Yeah. Hey, <laughs> I'm just wait, saying. one team Hold plays This is the first year I'll ever say that. Stack. You were supposed to wait for me in my dressing room. You were supposed to start before I got there. You <laughs> done started before I got there. Mm. You know what I'm saying, Joy? That's what I'm talking about. I shouldn't have told him where the, where the merchandise was. Uh, he so, done in the bag before he come out here talking about, <laughs> he talk about Jason Tatum going to lead the Celtics. Well, I, I got news for your man, LeBron James. But what is it? James Harden has run away and hidden from the MVP. No, he ain't run away, did They already gave him the award. Yeah, he said his house already. Over. It's just over. Why, over why would you try to make this late? Weak, lame case for yourself. We ain't making no case. We oh. just, we just doing what we do. Oh. We just playing that basketball. Do. Yeah. yeah, that's all. He, so, didn't, he didn't win the MVP a couple times. Excuse me, Skip. He didn't win the MVP a couple times when they had great records. Yeah, I know. I mean, they, for sure, ain't gonna win it this year. Yeah, because they gave the Steph Curry averaging twenty points one year. Mm. They should have gave it to LeBron his first year back in Cleveland, but they were mad at him. Do, do you they should have gave it to him when they gave it to D Rose. Yeah. Because you remember what he did to D Rose? Who was mad at LeBron for going back to Cleveland? They were mad at him. Who? Because. Everybody. Nobody was mad. Everybody was mad. Miami was mad. That's about it. With those voters. Just like he should have been that unanimous MVP and some rider gave it to Carmelo. Let's say he shouldn't have been unanimous. Well, I ain't going to say that, but he should have got defensive players. But yeah, yet with they Marcus gave it to Marcus Okay. okay. Yeah. Now tell the Then he would be right there with Mike if he had that. Yeah, but they didn't want him to be there right there with Mike, so they shortchanged him. Oh, they did it? They did. Who is they? <laughs> you know the rider. That's why I told him not to do the dunk contest. Because oh, they wanted to compare him to Mike. I said, uh, don't do it, Bron. Don't do it? Nope. Oh, so you were the one. Yep. You're the reason. Even when Magic, Ma- even when Magic said, "I give you a meal," yeah. said, "No, we can make more money by just sitting there chilling." So he took Nurkic's life. Woo! He never body did a dunk contest. He never did a dunk contest. Oh, got Joe Harris too on Sunday. Uh, got Joe oh, Harris. Body bag never a dunk contest. Oh, got Jason Terry. Oh. And got blocked by Wade twice last night. Yeah. Yeah. Kelly O'Leary. Steven Adams joining us. Kelly O'Leary fouled him too. Could the Browns take Baker Mayfield with the first <laughs> overall pick? We'll discuss that with Joel Klatt next.